Today I've been to Tenby School and had a presentation to about 100 students and I think eco-warrior is the best way to describe them. Plastic doesn't break down. Plastic was designed not to break down and yet we make items that we use once and then we throw them away and nobody asked where is away. They knew so much about the topic already, but I was able to give them a little bit more and open their eyes to what's going on, not just in Malaysia, but out in the ocean as well. And I see the oceans as the ultimate casualty of this crazy addiction that we have to single-use plastic. There was one character that we filmed that never made it into the final film. You know when you open a bottle, a juice bottle, you got it, still, there's still a ring around it. So she was a hatchling, she was a tiny turtle in the Mississippi River. And she swam into it and it got stuck. And can you imagine the pain that she must have gone through? They x-rayed her when she came in. There was no shell in the middle. She'd actually move in two halves. We ended up our morning session with a panel where six of the students came forward and I set a discussion topic for them and they then had a good think about it and came out with some fantastic comments. I think that people need to learn that drinking from bottled water, even though you're recycling it, you're sending a signal to corporations that it's fine for them to keep doing it in plastic because they'll keep buying. Yes. Don't underestimate your importance. I think that your generation and all of you here are the most important people on this planet. And we're very uh, um, pleased and delighted that Joe Ruxton was able to visit us today at our flagship school in KL. And it's a, a fantastic opportunity, I think, um, for our students um, to really impact uh, their community. I'm glad to be part of the Eco Initiative team so I can at least help raise awareness in my friends. I would probably encourage people more to save our planet as we only have one planet to live in. I feel that uh, every one of us can make changes to both the ways we impact the environment because I think that although individually the efforts account for very little, collectively as a group we can achieve a lot. It's a great opportunity from the British High Commission uh, to work with Tenby Schools SEP and it's something that we're very proud of uh, and we'd love to have Joe back again in the near future.